Good morning, everyone. Welcome to our functional fitness class. Today is Thursday, July 22nd. So welcome. Uh, functional fitness is a class that uh, does not involve any cardio. We work on our muscle and our endurance and our flexibility and resistance. Um, and our core. So we're going to be using some different exercises than some of the other classes. So we will be getting down on the floor to do some core work. You don't have to get on the floor. I will give you options to stand or sit if you do not want to get down on the floor. We're also going to be using a foam pad to stand on for some more um, core strengthening. If you don't have a foam pad, you can just stand on the floor. But we're going to get started with a warm-up. And again, our class is only about 40 minutes, so we work hard for a short period of time and you'll feel those muscles engaging. Let's get started. March it up. Big breath. Big breath. Good job. Toe tap. Just one look, and I felt so hot. Heel down. Up that heel, hamstring curl. Good. Knees up. Last four. Three. Two. Step up. Let's do a few narrow squats. 
squats here. Four more. Last two. Steps this way. Four, three, two, one. So you see, I really can't. Last four. Two more. And a mark. Toe tap for four, three, two, and a heel for four. Three, two, to the side, for four, three, two, to the back, for four, three, two, gentle kick back, gentle knee lift, last four, three, two, all right, good job, we should be loosened up, we're going to get our foam pad and our hand weights, you don't have to use the foam, you can stand on the floor. Because this is an intensity class, you're going to use the weights that you feel able. So a little heavier if you're able. Keep it light if you're just getting started. So we're standing on our foam. Again, you don't have to use it. Shoulders are back and down. We're going to try some squats. Down we go. Down we go. Keep that glute back. Keep going. Good. Two more. Stay here. Weights on your thighs. Knees are slightly bent, tummy tight. One arm at a time, shoulder height. Keep that tummy tight. Set that weight down on your thigh so you're not using momentum for those shoulders. Looking forward. Four more. Two more each side. One more set. Stand up. Weight at your side. One arm at a time reaching up. Here we go. Up, up, down, switch, up, reach. Now you should be able to see that weight slightly forward. Tummy tight, soft knees. Four more each side. Nice slow and controlled movements, three more. One more pair, we got it. Up, up, down and down. Last time. You got it, good job. Back to our squat, shoulders back. Tummy tight, soft knees, big breath. Down we go. You should feel those core muscles engaging as we're standing on that foam. Just challenging that balance. We got three more. Last one. Good. Stay slightly squatted. Soft knees. Weights on the thighs. Shoulder height. Tummy tight. Keep breathing. Getting into those shoulders and upper back here. Four more. Two more sets. Last pair. Good. Weights at the side. We're going to do both arms together. You don't have to. You can do one at a time. Here we go. Up for two. Down for two. Up 
up, down. Again, you can do one arm at a time if you wish, if you need to. You listen to how you're doing. Take a break if you need it. Last four. Three. Two more. One more. You got it. Put that down. And we're going to keep our foam. We're going to work on our balance. But we're going to use that foam. So you're going to put your back foot on the foam. You don't have to. If you find it too risky, back foot on the foam, facing to the side, front foot forward, weight to the back, and reach. Transfer the weight, and a reach. Try to really put some weight on the front, then on the back. This is how we improve our balance, transferring weight. Follow your hands with your eyes as you reach. Two more. Good, take your time, step off your foam, switch sides. Put that other foot on the back. Front foot facing forward, back leg, and reach. Transfer that weight, reach. So that foam just gives your gravity and your center of balance just a little off, so you engage those muscles to improve our balance. Four more. Three. Two. You got it. Step it in. All right. You're going to have your chair close by, just for security. We're not sitting down yet. All right. We're gonna stand beside our chair. Lift up one leg. Hold it up. Hold it. Hold it. Really squeeze that tummy. Look forward. Hold it. Hold it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. You got it. Switch sides. Get your balance. Strong leg. Lift it up, hold it, hold it, keep breathing, keep breathing, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, you got it, good job, all right, back to this side, this time we're going to do high knees, lift, lift, nice big knee, squeeze that tummy as you lift it up, squeeze it in. Squeeze it in. We're gonna add some arms if you're able. Arms up, knee up. Squeeze it up. Squeeze. Slow and controlled. We're getting into the core. We're doing balance here as well. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. You got it. Let's go back to one leg. Hold it up. Tummy tight. Breathing. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Switch. Other leg. Let's do those high knees on this side. Knee up. Knee up. Lift up. Arms if you wish. Squeeze. Squeeze. Slow and controlled. Control that leg. Don't drop it. Set it down. Eight. Squeeze that tummy. Four. Three. Two. All right. Other leg. Up we go. Hold it. Hold it. Breathing. Focusing. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Fantastic, good job. All right, we're gonna take our ball and we're gonna go over to the wall. We're gonna do some squats. 
So you're going to take that ball. All right, you have your ball. You're going to put that in your low back. You're going to step away from the wall. Feet are hip width apart. Shoulders are back and down. Tummy tight. We're going to squat down. Down we go. Back up. Down we go. Back up. Working on those quads, those big leg muscles. We'll try four more. Two more. Next one, stay down. Stay here, stay here. Now we're gonna lift our heels one at a time. Up, up, lift the heel. Up, up, lift up, up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Heels down, up we go, back down. Good work. Four more. Stay down, stay here. Heels up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Good job, come up. Ooh, those quads should be nice and toasty. Put your ball down. We're going to turn around. Face the wall. Hands on the wall above your head. We're going to take one hand away. The opposite leg. Squeeze the butt. Keep repeating the same side. One arm, opposite leg. Squeezing that glute. Getting into our low back. Squeeze that glute. Hand to the wall, then take it off. Squeeze that glute. Eight. We got four more. Two more. You're gonna hold that leg back. And pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, release it. All right, back to our squats. We're gonna do the other side after this one. Let's do those squats. Take your ball to your low back. Feet are out from the wall. Make sure the knees are above the ankles. Shoulders are back. Down we go. Down and up. Make sure you're breathing. Keep your feet out so that the knees do not go past the toes. Four, three, two, stay down. You know it, stay here. Big breath, blow it out. Big breath, up we go. Back down for eight, seven, six, last five, four, three, two, stay here. Heels for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, stay here, stay here, big breath. Again, big breath. Good job. Come on up. Good work. Shake out those thighs. We're going to go back to the wall for that other low back. Two hands above your head. Take your other arm off the wall, opposite leg. Squeeze that butt. Squeeze. Squeeze. Squeeze the glutes, low back strengthening, two more this way, hold it back and pulse for eight, six, four, three, two, good job, all right, back to our center, we're going to have a sip of water.
All right, folks. We're going to get on the floor. You don't have to. I will give you some options for seated if you don't want to get on the floor. We're going to be working on our core. All right. So I'll just show you seated. You're just going to sit, hands behind your back, knee in. We're going to do the very same thing on the mat. If you need some direction on how to get down safely on the mat, take a chair in front of you. Put your hands on the chair. Go down to your best knee, then the other knee, and then you sit down. All right. Here we are on the floor. All right. We're just going to sit up nice and tall. You can have your hands behind your back. You can leave them up. Knee in. Knee in. Squeeze that glute. Tum or sorry, squeeze the tummy. Knee in. Knee in. Squeeze that in. Eight. You can do the same thing seated. Four. Three. Two. One more. Good. All right. We're going to lie down. You can take one hand weight. You don't have to use the weight. I'm just going to show the folks that may be seated. We've done this before. You're going to be reaching forward, sit up, lift up. All right, that is the seated option. Lying down on your back. Knees are bent. Weight behind your head. If you're able, you sit up. You don't have to sit up. You can just reach up. I want you to keep your neck in alignment. That means you are looking at the ceiling. You are not looking down, looking up. You don't have to sit up. You don't have to use a weight. You listen to how you're doing. Take a break whenever you need to. Four more. If you're seated, you're alternating those knee lifts. Last two. Good. Stay up. Stay, stay sit, sitting up. You can do this on your chair. Heels are down. Tummy tight. Side. Center. Side. Tummy tight. Getting into those core muscles. Obliques on the side. Eight. Five. Four. Three. Two. One more pair. Good job. All right. Back to our first move. Weight down. Hands behind your back. Or none. Knee in. Knee in. Squeeze that tummy. Squeeze it in. Squeeze it in. Eight, seven, six, four, three, two, you got it. Grab your weight, lie down, knees are bent. Make sure that low back is pushed into the mat. Reach up, sit up. If you can't sit up, you just reach up. You're gonna look at the ceiling. Lift up. Do what you can. Sit up if you're able. You don't have to. Again, if you're seated, you're reaching forward. You're sitting up. Knee up. Lift up. Last four. Three. Two. Stay up. Stay seated. Heels on the floor. Tap. 
center side. We're not twisting, we keep our body forward. Last four. Three. Two. One more. Good job. All right, folks. We're gonna work on some legs. We're gonna lie on our side. I will show you standing before we do that. If you're standing, you're gonna take your leg to the side. We're just gonna do some side leg lifts. All right, on the floor, same move. On your side, on your side. Make sure your hips are stacked on top of each other. Bottom leg slightly bent, top leg extended, heel pushed out, lift it up. Hip height. So if you're standing, you just lift it out to the side. Out to the side. Lift up. You don't have to go high, just a little bit more than hip height. Make sure those hips are stacked. Four more. Three. Two. Hold it up, hold it up. Bend the knee. Bend the knee. Heel comes towards the glute. Good. Eight. Seven. Six. Getting into that glute and hamstring. Four. Three. Two. You're going to hold it out or hold it up. Little pulse. Little pulse. Little pulse. For eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, release it. Good job. All right, we're gonna do a plank in between. If you're standing, or instead of a plank, you can just do, uh, you can do a knee up. Uh, any, or, let's do this one if you're seated. You sit, hands are crossed, lean back, sit up. So we're squeezing that glute. Otherwise, on the floor, we're gonna try a plank. So we're on our tummies, on our tummy. Put your hands under your shoulders. Lift that tummy off the mat. Now you can stay right here on the knees. You can go to your toes. You squeeze your glute. Squeeze those glutes, butt down. Keep it low. Keep breathing for 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Good job, down you go. Take a break. Release it, take a break. This time, we're gonna go to elbows. If you have sore joints, you can stay on the hands. You can go to your elbows, whatever works for you. Lift that tummy off the mat to the knees or toes. Hold it low. You got it. Keep squeezing those glute muscles. Squeeze the glute. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, and down we go. Good job, release it out. Good job, all right. We're gonna flip over to our other side. So we're on that other leg now. Again, you can do it standing. Make sure those hips are stacked. Bottom leg slightly bent, top leg extended, heel pushes out, hip height and down. Hip height and down. Getting into that outer thigh here. Keep it strong. Make it purposeful. Make that leg totally in control. Up and down or out and in if you're standing. Last four. Hold it up or out. Bend the knee. Heel to butt. Squeeze the glute. Squeeze the glute. Bringing that heel in and out. 
eight, seven, six, four, three, two. Hold it out, little pulse, little pulse. Up and down, up and down for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Release it. All right, folks, we're gonna do one more set of planks. Let's go back to that tummy. You can do on your hands or your, or your elbows. Keep them at the shoulder, push it up. Knees or toes, hold it here, you got it. Tummy tight, glute is low. You're breathing, 10, nine, Eight. Four. Three. Two. Hold it. Stay here if you can. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Down we go. Good job. Woohoo. We're going to do one more just for good measure. We love it. One more time on those elbows or hands, whatever you like. Take it to the knees or toes. Here we go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Four, three, two, hold it. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Let's lean back, bring your butt back to your heels. Stretch out that low back. Good job. All right. We're gonna get up. I'll show you how to get up if you have trouble. Get your chair in front of you. Put your forearms on the chair. Go to your best leg. Push up, other leg up. Breathe. Breathing as you stand up. Have some water. All right, we're gonna do one little quick set with our hand weights. All right. With our hand weights. Let's do some bicep curls. Two arms together, soft knees, shoulders down. Here we go. Up, up, down and down. Up, up. Squeeze it up, down and down, up, up. So getting up and down off the floor, not your favorite thing to do. It's a really important task to try and practice once in a while. You never know when you're gonna need to know how to get up and down. Four more. Three. Two. One more. Good, all right, let's do our calf muscles and our shoulders. So up on our toes, shrug it up. Shrug it up. Shrug it up. Eight more. Strengthening those shoulders that support our head and neck and our calf muscles. Last four, three, two, good. Let's do a set of triceps. All right, you can do two weights, one weight. You can do it overhead, come sa, or to the side, elbow back. Whatever you need, do what you can. Over the head if you're able, push. 
reach, push, getting into the back of that upper arm so we can push ourselves up out of a chair and out of bed, reach, if you're doing one arm, let's switch the other side, back, elbow stays high, push, push, last four, three, two, good job, bring it down, all right, time is a flying, we're going to stretch, this is a quick class, you should feel like those muscles got a little workout, all right, let's bend our knee, knees together, pelvis tips forward, big breath, Stretching out that quad from our squats. Take your leg forward, other one back. Roll the shoulders back and down, hands on the low back. Slight lean forward. Open the chest, try to bring your elbows closer together. Hands to your front leg, back foot halfway in. Toe stays down, glute toward the ceiling. Look forward, soft knee. Feel that nice hamstring, glute stretch. Keep breathing. Feet together. Round it out. Roll up. Breathe in. Good. Let's do that other quad. Bend the knee. Knees together. You don't have to hang on to your shoe or your foot. You do what works for you. Knees together. Pelvis forward. Breathe. Good, take your foot forward, other foot back. This time, round out that upper back. Hands in front, open those fingers, stretch them apart. Wiggle them out. Hold it here. Hands to your front leg, back foot part way in, look forward. Glute to the ceiling. Feel that nice hip glute stretch. Feet together, roll it up, round out the back. Let's do that one more time for that low back. Down we go, round it out, round it out. All right, we gotta stretch our hips. We're gonna cross our feet. If you don't like this move, you don't have to. You can just keep your feet side by side, or you can have a seat. You put your foot on your knee and you lean forward. Otherwise, we're gonna take a big breath in and we bend down. And we hang out here. We hang out here where it feels okay. If you're able, circle those arms a little bit, little circles. We're stretching across the low back, across the hips. If you're seated, you sit up tall, then you sit slightly forward. Let's breathe in and stand up. Good, uncross the feet. Switch to the other side. Tall back, big breath. Down we go. Hang out here. Do what works for you. Go as low as you feel able. Keep breathing. Let's circle our arms. Gentle circles. If you're seated, you're sitting slightly forward, getting into that hip stretch. Gently breathe in, stand up. Uncross those feet. Big breath. Down we go. One more. Bring one hand down and the other. Give yourselves a hand. Thanks for joining us today. Good job. Have a great one. You're welcome.